I am back again today with another small video showing the Kubota SVL75 carrying the red oak which is finished splitting. Thanks for stopping by. Want to stop by as well today with some words of encouragement along with a small video. Thanks Angelina for showing the cap cut. It's been working out great. Kubota on the move with the red oak getting ready to put it in the backyard. Don't forget everybody, 10x everything you do. If you don't know what it is, look it up, Grant Cardone. Looking at the Kubota with the grapple. It's gonna make its way down the hill. For the next two minutes, we're gonna listen to a few words of encouragement. 10x everything you do. All right, everybody, until next time, small video. Take care, we'll talk soon. All your excuses are lies. Little lies that you think makes life easier, but they don't. Now I know in the morning, you got that blanket giving you a warm hug. And you got the, the pillow, which is whispering in your ear, telling you it's okay. Telling you to stay just a little longer. But don't listen to them. They're lying to you. Listen to your alarm clock, which is telling you to get up and get some. Listen to the weight room, the pull-up bar, which is telling you to face reality. And listen to your will, which is telling you to get up and crush everything, regardless of how you feel. Don't negotiate with weakness. Kill it. See, in life, you can go through life, you can come up with reasons or you can come up with results. You can come up with excuses or you can come up with achievements. You can go through life blaming or you can come up with solutions. The choice is in your hands, satisfaction or despair. We can choose that. You don't get better on the daggone couch. You get better by coming out here and getting the fuck after it every daggone day. When that alarm clock goes off at four or five in the morning, your mind says no. You just say, this is what we do now. My new norm is you get up every fucking morning at four o'clock and you suffer. That became my new fucking life. Most people want to get out of it. I said, no, motherfucker, this is your new life. This is who you are. I don't care how small it is. I don't care how minuscule the movement is, but make movement, move forward, and do that every single day, no matter what. You aren't getting any closer to your five-year plan or your three-year plan or your seven-year plan or any plan that you've got unless you get up and start getting after it today.